His work spans beyond the automotive sector and into the realm of energy generation, where he has pioneered the development of technologies capable of providing clean and sustainable energy to homes, industries, and even entire communities. This holistic approach to innovation underscores his deep understanding of the interconnectedness of technology, energy, and the environment. The fuel-free car is not just a one-off achievement, it is part of a broader movement that seeks to revolutionize the way we think about energy. As Chikambutso's invention gains traction, it is likely to inspire other innovators and entrepreneurs across the globe to think outside the box and develop solutions to some of the most pressing challenges facing humanity today. This could spark a new wave of technological advancement, with countries like Zimbabwe, historically overlooked in the global innovation race, taking the lead in creating solutions that will define the future of sustainable living. Despite the excitement surrounding the fuel-free car, there are still challenges ahead. As with any groundbreaking innovation, the path to widespread adoption is never without hurdles. Issues such as scaling up production, ensuring the affordability of the technology, and securing investment to bring the fuel-free car to market on a large scale will need to be addressed. Additionally, the car's ability to compete with existing alternatives, such as electric vehicles, will depend on its performance, range, and affordability. While the technology is undoubtedly revolutionary, its commercial viability remains to be fully tested in real-world conditions. Furthermore, there are potential regulatory challenges that may arise as governments and industries work to integrate such a disruptive technology into the existing transportation framework. The car industry is a complex and highly regulated sector, and introducing a fuel-free vehicle could require changes to policies and infrastructure on a global scale. Despite these challenges, the potential rewards of Chikambutso's invention cannot be overstated. If the fuel-free car succeeds in overcoming these barriers and becomes widely adopted, it could have a transformative impact on the automotive industry and the broader energy sector. For Zimbabwe, the successful commercialization of the car could lead to a surge in economic growth, job creation, and technological advancement, helping to position the country as a hub of innovation in Africa. For the world, it represents the possibility of a future where transportation no longer relies on fossil fuels and the devastating environmental consequences that come with them. The unveiling of the fuel-free car is just the beginning of what could be a revolutionary era in the world of automotive technology. And Sangilani Maxwell Chikambutso's name will likely be remembered as the man who helped spark a new chapter in the history of transportation and energy innovation. Sangulani Maxwell Chikambutso, a name that has been whispered in innovation circles for years, has finally delivered a breakthrough that has the potential to redefine the automotive industry globally. This momentous occasion took place in Zimbabwe, where Chikambutso, in collaboration with the Zimbabwean government, unveiled his groundbreaking fuel-free car, an invention poised to change the way the world thinks about energy consumption and sustainable transportation. The event was held under the watchful eye of none other than Zimbabwe's President Emerson Mnangagwa, who, in a symbolic gesture of support, stood beside Chika Mbutso as the world watched with bated breath. The unveiling of the car marks the culmination of years of research, perseverance, and unwavering dedication to a vision that many thought was a pipe dream, yet here it stands, ready to take on the established order of fuel-powered vehicles. Chikambutso's fuel-free car runs on an entirely innovative technology that does not rely on traditional fossil fuels or electricity as we know it. The car represents a dramatic departure from the standard model of internal combustion engines or battery-powered vehicles that dominate the market today. Instead, it taps into a unique and self-sustaining energy source, one that uses a combination of electromagnetic technology and principles of renewable energy that have never been fully realized until now. For years, Chikambutso has been working on perfecting his vision of a car that could function without contributing to the environmental degradation caused by conventional cars. His passion was fueled by a deep concern for the planet's future and a desire to offer a solution that could address the twin crises of climate change and the depletion of fossil fuels. In doing so, Chikambutso has not only demonstrated technical brilliance, but also a profound sense of responsibility toward the planet's sustainability. 
As the car was unveiled, it quickly became clear that this was more than just a personal achievement for Chika Mbutso. It was a monumental moment for Zimbabwe and the African continent as a whole. Zimbabwe, a country that has long been associated with economic challenges, political instability, and underdevelopment, was now at the forefront of one of the most innovative inventions of the 21st century. This moment marked a historical turning point for both the country and the African continent, positioning Zimbabwe as a leader in sustainable technology. With the eyes of the world on Zimbabwe, President Amnungagwa's presence at the event was not just symbolic, it was a reflection of the country's commitment to fostering innovation and nurturing homegrown talent. His endorsement of the fuel-free car was an indication of the government's support for inventions that could stimulate economic growth and propel Zimbabwe into the global technological conversation. The collaboration between Chika Mbutso and the government signifies a shift in Zimbabwe's approach to innovation, embracing new technologies, and offering hope for a future where Zimbabwe can become a powerhouse of cutting-edge solutions. Beyond the political and economic implications, the invention of the fuel-free car speaks volumes about the progress of human ingenuity. For decades, the automobile industry has been under the scrutiny of environmental activists, as gas-guzzling vehicles have been a major contributor to the acceleration of climate change. The transportation sector alone is responsible for a significant portion of global carbon emissions and the push for cleaner, Greener alternatives has never been more urgent. Chika Mbutso's car, which operates without emitting harmful pollutants, presents a solution that is both technologically advanced and ecologically responsible. Moreover, its development challenges the very foundation of the global oil and energy industries, which have long held a monopoly over the automotive market. This invention could potentially disrupt global supply chains, especially the fossil fuel industry, which stands to lose its dominance if the fuel-free car gains widespread adoption. Yet, it is important to recognize that Chikambutso's achievement goes beyond merely offering a cleaner alternative. It represents a broader vision for energy independence. His invention holds the potential to pave the way for a world where energy is no longer controlled by centralized power structures, but can be generated and sustained through decentralized, renewable sources. This vision is not just about creating a new type of vehicle, it's about reshaping the way humanity thinks about energy consumption, resource management, and sustainability. The unveiling of the fuel-free car also places a spotlight on Chika Mbutso's other ventures in the field of energy innovation. In addition to his work on the car, Chika Mbutso has been involved in the development of various energy technologies that seek to harness natural resources in ways that are both efficient and environmentally friendly.